the five main mistakes that people make when they fill out the CAO. Number one, the first one would be students missing the deadline. Now, this seems very obvious, but the deadline for the CAO is the 1st of February. You do it online, it's 40 euro. But everybody is encouraged by CAO to use the deadline of the 20th of January, where you fill it up online for 25 euro. The second mistake, the common mistake that people make would be entering personal details incorrectly. A lot of students put in the wrong date of birth. Now this is a real problem because when they go back to it, they cannot access any part of the CAO form without if they have the wrong date of birth. Now this is not really a problem if you are trying to do this during April, May, June, but if you're doing it before the final close up date on the 1st of July, you could have panic not being able to get into it. So it's important that you check your personal details. The third common mistake that people make would be not um, taking note of restrictions and minimum entry requirements. This is quite serious. A lot of courses have minimum entry requirements. For example, if you're doing a level 8 engineering course, you need to have a C3 in honours maths. If you're doing veterinary medicine, you need to have a C3 in chemistry. You need that subject. If you're doing pass maths and you want to go to UCD, for example, and do science or commerce, you must have a B3 on the pass maths paper. Now, if you get 600 or 625 points, and you do not meet that entry requirement, your points are in effect zero. There are a lot of courses in Ireland where something else besides points are involved. For example, if I'm doing medicine, that's a restricted course because there's a HPAT involved. If I'm doing music in most colleges, there's an audition that they're restricted. Um, art and design, you have to give a portfolio, etc. Now, these courses must be included by the 1st of February. In fact, the 1st of March, you, after the 1st of March, you cannot introduce them. So if you are somebody and you think, I want one of these restricted courses or I'm not sure, put it down before the 1st of February. You can take it out at a later stage, but at least you've given yourself time and more options. The fourth common mistake is my very favorite. Um, here in the Institute, it, we talk about this all the time. It's not placing courses in genuine order of preference. Now we have a mantra here, we almost sing a song here. We assume you're going to get 600 or 625 points. You put down what you want first, what you want second, what you want third. Students do not do this. And this is the main reason why people do not get their course in August. Now CAO will tell us why do people not do this? Um, they make decisions, they look at last year's points, which is nothing to do with this year's points. We have seen cases in the past where computer courses were very high, there might have been some freeze and points can drop 200 at least. Um, they add up their own points and decide I'm going to get 400 points for example and they underestimate what they're going to get. You don't go there. I think people put them down for reasons like my friend is doing that course so I will do it. That's unbelievable but it happens. And lastly, you know, I don't think you should put down a course to please your parents or please some member of your family. I think you go back to basics which is, I am going to put down first the course I want the most. And if you do that, you will not go wrong. And finally. I suppose the most common mistake would be, according to CAO, not checking your statement of application record. You will get this in May, a simple statement from CAO. Now I know May is a really busy month, people are very stressed and hassled, but if you take that statement and you just look at it, it will take you three minutes. You just check your name is correct. You check your date of birth is correct. You check things like your exam, your leaving cert exam number is there. And most importantly, if you've got an exemption, say in Irish and French, you check it's on that form. It will take you so little time. And by doing this, you really will make life so easy for yourself in August.